So how are you guys doing today? My name is Kryptonic and today I'm going to be talking about the Eco Pro microphone. So if you guys do end up enjoying the video, remember to leave a like and a comment down below. And anyways, guys, let's get straight into the video. So now this video was supposed to come out a long, long, long time ago, but for some reason it wasn't working and I couldn't figure out what it was. And it was something with Adobe Premiere Pro, but I fixed everything. And now, you know, this is coming to you guys. So this is a condenser microphone and this is a microphone like any other microphone that I've I've done you guys have seen my top two microphones for gaming for YouTube and stuff like that and this was definitely one of those microphones that could have been up there but it wasn't because at the time I didn't have it so there was no way of me knowing now like I said last time in the other video that I did about condenser microphones sometimes condenser microphones do require a little bit of a boost since your sound card cannot give out enough power and you can choose it this one was not really too power thirsty so it did have a little bit of background noise if you didn't use like a USB adapter or anything like that to make it work better but it still works without it just by plugging into the audio jack also this microphone felt extremely solid I don't think I've felt a microphone like this the only other microphone that I've felt that was as solid as this one was my audio technica the one i'm talking into right now and this microphone it ranges from 70 to 90 dollars depending on the time of the year because amazon of course you know likes to fluctuate with the prices and this microphone is really heavy and you know it just feels very very solid and stable and that's exactly how this uh eco pro microphone felt it felt very solid and it gives you a little attachment so you can add it into your boom arm or whatever you want and overall it just works very great and i'm very impressed with the quality because because most microphones yeah they're like decent but they're made out pretty crappy with crappy materials and eventually they just break down if you drop it it breaks this one feels like if you drop it it could take a couple hits I know I've dropped my microphone I don't even know how it happened I left it on my desk and then it rolled off and it landed on carpet but it still like scared me because microphones are very very fragile and don't ask how but I also dropped the Eco Pro microphone. It was on my desk again, and it just kind of rolled off my mat. And then even after that, it still worked perfectly fine. Everything was still working, and I was just very shocked to see how durable the microphone itself is. Now, like I said, this microphone is very cheap and very affordable for any content creator out there starting up their own channel. And if you guys don't know, condenser microphones are actually really good. It just depends on what uh, what you get. Like uh, if you guys get a mix board or anything like that, that's going to make the microphone sound like a million dollars. Any condenser microphone in the $30 price range to anywhere higher than that. If you guys have like a mix board and you guys plug that in and you guys actually get the sound out, it's probably going to sound better than my Audio Technica because my Audio Technica is just a usb microphone and usb microphones are actually very underrated but they are decent microphones but compared to you know condenser microphones and then everything that comes with it they are a lot better and you know usb microphones are just easier that's why everyone buys them but you know condenser microphones if you guys want the purest quality sound you guys should definitely go check that out so now this is what the microphone itself sounds like i mean if i had a like an audio condenser mix board something like that it would be a lot better but right now this is what it sounds like purely plugged into the audio jack into my computer and this is without any phantom power going into it but anyways guys hopefully you guys enjoyed the video and if you did remember to leave a like and a comment down below tell me down below if you guys do have the microphone in the last microphone videos i did um you guys did leave comments saying that you guys own the microphones and you guys are very happy with it tell me down below if you guys own this microphone i really want to know your guys opinion personal opinion and you know experiences with this microphone because so far i have have not had a single issue with this microphone and it's just pretty good so far anyways guys hopefully you guys have a great day and i'll see you guys around in my peace guys